basically just to give them a taste of the kind of actions that are going to happen while they're deployed and the kind of combat scenarios that they're going to be dealing with. In a, in a, in a firefight, you're going to have a lot of gunshots going off. You're going to have rounds going down range. So you need to be able to kind of compartmentalize and block out all the noise and be able to still provide effective patient care. So we're kind of giving them a taste of that right now with the gear they're wearing, with the smoke, with the pyros, uh, with the gunshots, with the sounds, to kind of effectively train them and prepare them for what they're going to be dealing with mentally. We learned how to deal with massive hemorrhaging, providing patient and provider safety on the course, how to give artificial airways using either cricothyroidomy procedure or cric procedure, uh, emergency airways, uh, how to deal with sucking tension wounds, how to identify different common fatalities that have happened and preventable, potentially preventable deaths in previous wars. It's mission critical, it's mission essential. Without this kind of training that we have going on in the background and what we put our sailors through, we wouldn't be prepared, we wouldn't be prepared to deploy. We would not be effective on deployment in our combat scenario.